Let me just place my baby. Hi over there, welcome back to this YouTube channel. My name is Yulia and in today's clip, you could tell by the title and probably by my hair if you are subscribed already and religiously watch my video clips. First of all, thank you. Second of all, if you're not subscribed, subscribe. I post weekly, at least a video, if not more. So obviously today it's not makeup. I do makeup content and I ended up buying myself wigs from Shein. I was a weirdo who had no clue Shein is not only about makeup. <laughs> Obviously, I'm following uh, Steph Toms and Jordan Lipscomb and they both did, you know, some makeup testing stuff about Shein. I'm pretty sure also Jordan, Steph Toms for sure. I had no clue they offer more, including wigs. So, I have three of them to test out. This is the a black, both of them are short. This is the longest on my head. This is the black one, a gray blonde-ish. It's gray, actually it's gray. Yeah, if you wanna see actually how I put this one and also the rest, I'm gonna try all of them, then keep on watching. So obviously let me start with the one I have on my head. This one, I don't have my stuff prepared. Oh. YouTuber wanna be, I'm still learning, all right? So, the nat nature long curly wig with bangs in shade blue, obviously. It retails full price for 15.99 pounds. I purchased it with 13.55, just because I had like a code. I'm pretty sure they usually have codes on their website anyway, so you know, check that out. But yeah, let me tell you this. I tried all of them already, so I think this is my favorite. I always wished to dye my hair this color. The only thing I would say about the bands is that they were much longer, I had to trim them. I will insert a picture next to me over here of how long they were. I took a picture obviously with, with no makeup but it doesn't matter, you need to see the bangs, how long they were. I also have a tiny face, not gonna lie about that. Oh, I hate faces tiny, I am also a short person, so, you know, yeah. But it, it wasn't hard, the way I did it is literally kind of like picked up this into a ponytail and literally took this one as I'm showing you now, I don't know how to explain that. I'm not into hair. Um, that's why I bought wigs. I'm more into makeup. So yeah, I have a hard time with, with hair, but if I can do it, you can do it too. So literally I got the scissors and I trimmed them as such. I did not cut them straight. I felt that was much safer to make sure I don't destroy this um, thing. And well, it was actually easy. It took around an hour because I was scared I'm gonna mess up, so I took my time. But yeah, I also bought this kind of like socks sort of thing that are actually for the head. I have it underneath. I'm gonna insert some pictures of when I applied this, how I did it. I put this basically on my head and then put this little thingy. It also, like it has lace and it also has some things to kind of put, how to explain it? It's like elasticated, let me, you know. Let me just open and show you on another one. Makes more sense. I'm opening the black one. This is how it comes, you know, um, what is it called? Shush! This is how it comes, you know, packed. It has this kind of a thing. I'm gonna keep them. I'm actually gonna keep them. I'm not gonna throw them away. And here we go. So inside it has these little things, right? And also kind of like places where to pin them, if that makes sense. So the way I did it is I pinned it around the second one. Like it has one, two, three, four, five, five of them, six on this one actually. So I pinned each of them because it has two on the second thingy and literally just put it on my head, as you've seen probably with the blue one. So it actually stays really put on my head. I like that. It doesn't feel like it's gonna fall. I feel like I can do this. 
and be like, oh, super, all right. I am pretty much very sure I'm gonna wear this one in the, in the world, not only for the makeup uh, Instagram bits. Yeah, I post a lot on Instagram. I actually have the tutorial of this makeup look. Maybe check it out. The same. Also, when I placed the sock, I firstly tried to braid it. My hair is not that thick, so I realized I was complicated in my life and I just literally tucked it in and it was fine. It's fine. I have it tucked in and you probably will be able to see it now. Oh, hello world. This is the reality. So it kind of, you know, moves around obviously. Um, but it's not the end of the world. We are just putting it back and see it's stuck in behind. I think it's a bit small. I'm not gonna lie. My head is quite small and I still think I preferred it bigger, but it's fine. It was two pounds, the socks, the sock. I'm just gonna, I mean, there are two pairs. What if they're just selling the socks? <laughs> no, it's called stretchable wig net cap and it's 199 full price and I paid 175 70. Anyways, let's try the black one. This one, the short wig with bangs retails for 799 and I paid 680 because obviously I had the code. So you've seen how I you know put these things and literally what I'm gonna do. Oh, this is not put well. Let me just correctify that. So the way I do it is literally Make sure, because these have bangs, make sure I don't, you know, catch them. And drag this all the way behind. And someone is gonna entrap me. Hello, Horatio! Hi. <laughs> so, this one, it's really nice, but again, I have the same problem. The bangs, bangs? I'm pretty sure they're called bangs. Because that's how it's called short wig with bangs, right? So literally, I mean, I it, this one is fine when it comes to the the bangs. They are not that long. I can cope with it. However, uh, for my tiny face, they are still getting into my eyes. But it doesn't bother me. I know my face is tiny, so I'm gonna you know get used to that. I might have to trim them, or I'm just gonna drag it like this like literally drag it more in the back but yeah literally this looks really nice for the quality and the money i paid for it this is actually insane i really like how it sits on my on my skin on my head and literally these the only thing i would say is that i need to sort how i'm gonna make them stay nice because obviously it's a synthetic synthetic it's a it's not natural hair right so i can't put my curler inside it and do stuff so yeah that's the only thing i would say um the person who actually showed me where to get them because it was someone who recommended them to me because i had no clue they sell wigs on she in right uh she said she sometimes styles them with with a uh, cream or um, you know, styling hair products because you can actually, I mean, it's actually advised to clean these ones on the website. So yeah, I never did that. I'll probably do it not, you know, anytime soon. So yeah, it's quite long at the back. It doesn't look weird. I actually like it. It's really good. So let's just jump within the next one. So again, this comes with bangs. That's the only thing I noticed. They don't have that many without bangs, especially the colors I wanted to. Um, or for example, the black, I'm pretty sure they had one without bangs, but it was more expensive and I was trying to save some coin at the same time. So again, same thing with the lace. I'm gonna put it, oh, this, these actually don't have the label taken down, but anyways, I'm not gonna take it down. So, Putting it there. Low, high. So uh, sometimes I forgot to say this. 
obviously you know make sure this is on the middle I'm pretending like I know that much about wigs when in reality this is the first time I ever wore wigs this is the short bob wig with bangs um, this was actually more expensive than the, than the black one this was I mean it retails for $12.99 and I paid $11.04 and again, the wig, the wigs, the bands are big. However, I feel this one has a style that I can definitely pull it off like, actually no, it was the same with the other one. I mean, no, I can, I can pull it off like having it on, you know. I used to do this when I was smaller, I had bangs. Um, and I used to place them like that when they were too long. So I'm gonna try to do that now. Obviously, I need to drag this even more down. Yeah, no, it's too long. I'm trying to pretend like I can save it, but I can't. So this was the same situation with the blue one. The bangs are way too long for my face, right? Ah, oh, it gets into my eyes. I don't like that. I really don't. So what we are gonna do is actually, like that's, this is actually what I did with, wait one second. So I, I took, the first time I tried it, two bobby pins and I pinned them a bit just to make sure they don't get into my eyes. Come on. Come on. So this is what I did also in the day when I tried them the first to save them. Like, especially this one. I feel this one works this way. The blue one for some reason it just didn't look good. But I think this way it looks really, really nice with this with this gray one. Um, at the same time, you can see a bit like of weirdness over there. So I would still maybe try to trim it at some point. But for now, it doesn't bother me. It's fine. It actually looks really nice. I really like the color. I'm not gonna pretend I don't because why would I? <laughs> Like why would I? It just it really looks good. The only thing I would say is with this t-shirt, I do have this kind of problem. It, I feel it washes me off because it's gray and obviously the hair is gray as well. But other than that, again, it's it sits really nicely. I don't find it weird at the back, you know, I don't feel like it's gonna fall off if especially I will get like a wig glue so I can glue it down like as such, you know, cause you can glue them. Uh, yeah, maybe, maybe there are people who are like me and they're never tried wigs. I feel you, I feel you, but apparently you can take this part and glue them as such. Um, and it kind of makes sense, you know, it will look very, very natural. So you can actually do that. Like the fact that it does have those kind of like trimmed parts where you can make sure you can drag them and glue them down i think it makes sense that these are actually quite good for the price i don't find them expensive i actually like them i really do so i've obviously i never tried other wigs before as uh, you know uh except the ones from poundland i think everybody has tried the ones from poundland they are shit um, these are not like that at all. They are really good, but obviously they're not a pound. Um, but at the same time, they I don't think they, you know, they are expensive. I think if you wish to, I don't know, dye a color like I want myself to dye my hair blue, I think this is a good opportunity to make sure you're not gonna regret it and buy yourself a wig. Do, did I need free? No, but did I buy it free? Well, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's literally it. I also have some tattoos, but I'm not gonna speak about them today. But if you want to see the tattoos when I apply them and so on and so forth, because obviously I did not try them, so that's why I don't want to include them in here as well. But if you are interested in, in the tattoos from Shein as well, then definitely leave me a comment down below. You know, tell me that you want to see that. And if you did not already subscribe, Give it a try. I don't do, you know, hair stuff. I don't, I might do. I started to get into hair during this quarantine because I feel my Instagram looked boring without having my hair to some extent like 
in a way. That's why I bought these ones as well, because these are much simpler to just put them on rather than braid my hair, my own hair. Um, but I do a lot of makeup. I love makeup. And obviously, I do sometimes once in a while hauls, but I invest my money more mostly in makeup. I prefer to not buy clothes and buy makeup most of the times. Or jewelry. I have an obsession with my earrings. But yeah, if you're interested in that kind of a content, then definitely subscribe. Hit that notification bell button just because I upload every single week on Tuesday and Thursday. However, if I can upload in other days, too i definitely do like i love editing and doing youtube clips i love instagram as well so you know check me out there and tiktok maybe i'm gonna become tiktok famous if not youtuber or instagram famous we'll see but yeah i hope this clip was by any means useful and relevant and it gave you an idea whether you would like to purchase some wigs from shein i definitely give it a massive thumbs up a massive thumbs up i love them so much so that is it from me for today i'll hopefully see you within the next one bye